Worse future of humans with antibiotic resistance. What if I told you that a simple cut on your finger could kill you in the near future? Sounds impossible, right? But this terrifying reality might be closer than you think. We're heading toward a world where basic infections could become death sentences, where routine surgeries become too risky to perform, and where medicines that have saved millions of lives simply stop working. This isn't science fiction. This is the growing threat of antibiotic resistance. Today, we're diving deep into what could be the darkest chapter of human health. And trust me, by the end of this video, you'll understand why scientists are calling this one of the biggest threats to humanity. Let me start with a story that will chill you to the bone. In 2016, a woman in Nevada died from an infection that resisted every single antibiotic available in the United States. Every single one. 26 different antibiotics couldn't save her life. This wasn't some rare tropical disease. It was a common bacterial infection that had become completely untreatable. Now imagine this scenario becoming normal. Picture a world where antibiotics are as useless as candy against infections. This is exactly where we're heading if antibiotic resistance continues to grow. But how did we get here in the first place? The problem started with our success. When Alexander Fleming discovered penicillin in 1928, it was like finding a magic bullet against disease. Suddenly, infections that killed millions became treatable overnight. We got so confident that we started using antibiotics everywhere. Doctors prescribed them for viral infections where they don't even work. Patients demanded them for every cold and flu. Farmers began pumping them into healthy animals to make them grow faster. We treated antibiotics like they were unlimited resources, but bacteria are incredibly smart survivors. Every time we use an antibiotic, we're essentially training bacteria to resist it. The weak bacteria die, but the strong ones survive and multiply. Over decades, we've accidentally created an army of superbacteria. These superbugs are resistant to multiple antibiotics, and some are resistant to all of them. Now let's paint the picture of our potential future. In this antibiotic-resistant world, a small scratch from gardening could lead to a life-threatening infection. Routine surgeries like hip replacements or appendix removal would become extremely dangerous. Cancer patients undergoing chemotherapy would face almost certain death from simple infections. Giving birth would return to the dangerous process it was a century ago. Pneumonia would once again become a major killer of children and elderly people. Even dental procedures could result in fatal blood infections. The death toll would be staggering. Scientists predict that by 2050, antibiotic-resistant infections could kill 10 million people every year. That's more than cancer kills today. To put this in perspective, that's one person dying every three seconds from untreatable infections. Hospitals would transform from places of healing into danger zones. Healthcare workers would live in constant fear of catching untreatable diseases from their patients. Entire hospital wards would need to shut down to contain outbreaks of superbugs. The economic impact would be devastating, too. Healthcare costs would skyrocket as patients require longer hospital stays and more expensive treatments. Many life-saving medical procedures would become too risky to perform. A global economy could lose trillions of dollars as millions of people become too sick to work. Developing countries would suffer the most. Places that already struggle with healthcare infrastructure would see massive increases in preventable deaths. Diseases that we eliminated decades ago could make deadly comebacks. Tuberculosis, which we nearly defeated, is already showing signs of extensive drug resistance. But the scariest part isn't just individual deaths, it's how this could change our entire way of life. Modern medicine, as we know it, depends on antibiotics working. Without them, we'd essentially go back to medical practices from the 1920s. Families would live in constant fear of simple injuries and common illnesses. Parents would watch helplessly 
as their children fight infections that should be easily treatable, the average human lifespan could drop significantly. All the medical advances of the past century would become meaningless if we can't fight basic infect. Pharmaceutical companies often avoid investing in antibiotic research because it's not profitable enough. We're essentially losing the race against time. The bacteria are evolving faster than our ability to create new weapons against them. This future doesn't have to become reality. But it will require immediate action from governments, doctors, patients, and every single one of us. We need to use antibiotics responsibly, support research into new treatments, and take this threat seriously. The choice is ours. Act now or face a future where a simple infection could end everything. What scares you most about this potential future? Let me know in the comments below. If this video opened your eyes to this crisis, please share it with your friends and family. Hit the like button if you want to see more content about important health topics. And don't forget to subscribe for more eye-opening videos about the future of humanity.